Welcome to another Business Talk video, the series of videos on business and business subjects which I have put together, drawn from my own experience and from extensive research and studies which I've um, gone through to help you better understand some of the dynamic concepts which surround business in the digital domain and also in real life. I'm David Amarland and today we are going to talk about what I call the sunglasses moment. I have on YouTube a link to a deeper resource on this, so I would urge you to check it out because it gives you a lot more uh, information and it backs it up with scientific studies. But essentially what a sunglasses moment is, is the point in your communication, whatever, whatever that communication may be, advertising, messaging, marketing, website, content, or an article somewhere, which limits the amount of information that can be conveyed in an instant. I'll demonstrate this literally with a pair of sunglasses, hence the name, the sunglasses moment. I'm going to put the pair of sunglasses that, which I have here on. And all I've done here is removed from you the ability to see my eyes. Eyes in a face play a critical role when it comes for us humans who have the unique um, aspect of having white around our eyes, which allows us to determine the direction of the gaze of the person we're talking to. When we can't see the direction of that gaze, then we're less disposed to trust them, less disposed to listen to them, less disposed to think that they're empathic or empathetic towards us, and less disposed towards any kind of uh, contact or communication with them because trust isn't there. I take the sunglasses off and instantly the effect changes. Now, all you have to do <laughs> and I say all within inverted commas because it's actually a lot, is to think what sunglasses moments exist in your website, in the content you create, in the messaging you put in place, in the marketing you actually engage in, or the advertising that you have um, in, in effect. If you can identify the sunglasses moment and remove it, then immediately you increase the trustworthiness, perceived trustworthiness, and um, effectiveness of what you do. Contact and engagement increase, which then it means it's more likely that you're going to find the people you want to convert into customers for your business. I know none of this is easy to, to sort of conceptualize immediately, but it is a lot to think about. I sincerely hope it gives you some idea of what you should be doing. Uh, like I said, there's gonna be more resources in the um, resource box on YouTube, check it out. Let me know in the comments below how you found this. Let me know how you're doing generally. Keep on uh, sending me the emails that you do with suggestions and ideas. Uh, always take them on board. Take care. Stay safe. Until next time.